Working on the weekend like usual Way off in the deep end like usual Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit your block up, I tell you if it was us Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush how can I help you? I have a code. What are the numbers? Um, 1037. What would you like? Please stay home. Bitch, this is fame, not clout. I don't even know what that's about. Watch your mouth. Maybe got an ego twice the size of the crib. I think I ended um, the last clip at breakfast this morning, but I don't really know if the lighting is really good in here. I don't know. But I am outside Big Lots and the beauty supply store, and I just dropped Prince off next door to that at Petco. So I have everything that I need over here in this little outlet. Um, Prince is getting groomed right now. His appointment is at 1.30. I dropped him off at about like 1.22ish. So he goes to a lady named Melissa. So if you have like Yorkie Morky, whatever little dog like that, she's really good Pomeranian. She's in there doing a Pomeranian right now. But I kind of want this to be a spend the day with me. So if you're new here, hey, my name is Akira Janae. Don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave. So I think first I'm gonna go to, um, I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store just to like get that out of the way because I think I only need like three items out of there and Big Lots is the one I'm gonna be in for a minute. So the beauty supply store I need, I wanna try like hair glue, like actual like bold hold or something. So I'm gonna, no, Ghost Bond. I think Ghost Bond was the good one. <laughs> so I'm gonna get Ghost Bond. I need some hair pins for when I curl my hair to keep it, you know, the um curls in longer. And then I'm going to get a lace grip holder. So like when I do glueless installs like this one, this isn't glued down. I want that little lace grip so it doesn't slide. But I got an elastic band in this. But anyways, only need a few items. And then Big Lots, they actually got like some sales going on. So I'm about to go in there and basically like household items is what I need out of here. Literally that's all. So yeah, I'm gonna get in before everybody get these Tide Pods. They got, if you spend over $35, you get a free pack of 15 or 20 count Tide Pods. So baby, we're about to get in there and get the deals. So I'm about to go in. Um, I'm gonna vlog a little bit while I'm in there. I don't want this video to be too long. So it's gonna be kind of like bits and pieces of you know what I'm getting, what's in my basket. And then when I get home from all these stores I'm going to today, I'm just gonna do a whole little like, I guess a haul you can say so let me put my glasses back on and go in and someone's looking at me right now yes baby i am vlogging so let's go Okay, so I am on the Samel Goods aisle. Um, they like to play music in here. I forgot when I used to work here, you know. <laughs> but yeah, I don't wanna get demonetized, so I'm probably just gonna be like doing basically like B-rolls and voiceovers possibly, but I do need some more wall plugins. So here they are. Um, I thought it was a three pack for $10, but I may be mistaken. I think it is just the two but i need a huge pack of airwick so i'm probably gonna have to go 
to like Walmart or Kroger's for the Airwick because you can get like six or seven for like ten dollars of that. So I think I'm gonna go for that. And so I'm on my last um, Swiffer wet jet little like refill thing. So I have this one at the house and I have this one. This one is what I use to mop with and then this one is what I use for like sweeping up dust. spray I've ever seen usually you know like the it's like poopery or whatever poopery is usually like five six dollars this right here is called poopsie daisy and it's literally only one dollar so I'm about to get like three of these <laughs> I'll leave one for someone else but literally one of these is like five dollars at like TJ Maxx Walmart for the poopery and this smells so good I just smelled it it's a citrus fragrance I smell more kind of like lemon though but definitely getting three of those I'm really feeling this like for a table topper but I don't know where I would put this. Like, it can't fit on my dining room. Maybe under my TV. I can move that home thing. I don't know, I'm really feeling it though. I think I may get it and then if it don't work, I'll like bring it back. But I don't know, I'm just really feeling this. It is just so crazy how much stuff they've gotten in because when I was working here, we were not carrying all these big name brand items. It is just so crazy. Like, this is kind of cute. I would get this for my mom. $22? Probably not, but this was like $10. I would definitely get that for her. How stinking cute. Let's take this overboard now. I want you to and we can ride the book and share that feel of love. I want to ride. So while I was in here shopping, I literally just bought a bar cart. So I'm gonna need some 
cups and stuff for the barbecue. Yeah, yeah. Those are 15 for oh, four. That's a little high. Like, these ones look really cute. These are only $11.99. I think I like these. Let's see. Ooh, these are. Ooh, yeah, I like these. It's thin though, so if I drop this, baby, this is breaking. This is like really thin glass. But I'm gonna get it. I like it. So if y'all remember when I vlogged that guy, well, the valet trash man, he literally took my sign. Um, it was like a little foldable welcome sign that was in this material from here. Um, this is kind of like it. This one's $14. $14. The one that I had, the actual little, like foldable stand, it was 10. I mean, this is only $4 more and I mean, it's basically the same thing. It's just like a little seat and then you put your plant right here. The other one I had was like a, I don't know, I'll insert it and let you guys remember it. But I think I'm gonna get this one because I really want this to go outside my door. I like having a plant outside the door and just outside regardless. But I also found this cute sign this one is $18 and it says welcome like this is so cute I don't think I should have both of these at my door like it should be one or the other I feel like or I can have one on one side I don't know. I'm just gonna get this for now and go buy me a plant. And they had like six or seven of these, so I'm gonna wait on this and then I may come back for it. Where did these niggas be at when they say they doing all this and all that? Tired of beefing you bombs, you can't even pay me enough to react. Been waking up in the crib, but sometimes I don't even know where I'm at. Please don't pay that nigga sounds in this party, I can't even listen to that. Anytime that I run into somebody, it must be a victory lap. Hey. Shotty come sit on my lap, hey, they saying Tracy just snap. This is between us, it's not like a store, this isn't a closable gap, hey. I see some niggas attack. So I just picked up me some McDonald's. McDonald's. <laughs> Cause you uh, was on my ass last time. I said that. And I get the orange fan of now, why is the... My camera not white balanced right now. It's it's, it's, it's come on now okay anyways i got this instead of the sprite i've been on the um fan of orange for a minute now but i'm in my parents house um i'm still waiting on prince to get out the groomers so i dropped him off at 1 30 he probably won't be done until like 3 34 they was like give them a lot of time today because they said it was a um a big dog in there like was going crazy so it took a lot of them to hold that dog down but I'm about to go eat, spend time with my mother, and then when I leave from here, I'll get back with y'all. I'm gonna go pick up Prince, and then I'm going to the outlet mall, and then we're gonna um, shop around. I just picked up y'all bad little nephew, y'all cyber nephew, and make sure it focus. Melissa and told me he been trying to bite. Hey, yeah, you was trying to bite her. Or just bite. I guess be when she um got to his um, I think his paws or something. She said I don't I don't really remember. But I'm gonna have to bring him like every four to five weeks. She said we missed a month, so that's why. So on his next appointment, I'm gonna um schedule out exactly four weeks from today and have him come more. I actually may schedule in like two weeks a bath so he can like remember what's going on and then schedule baths in between his appointments in between his haircut appointments so i think that'll probably help so about two and a half weeks from now i'm gonna schedule a bath in a trim and i'm driving again i'm on my way to take him home and then i'm going to the outlets to do a little bit more shopping just a little bit and then i'll go back to the house and give y'all a haul what's up <laughs> I'm 
Now I'm on my way to Sephora. Oh, they do have the refills in store. I did not know that. So my damn belly button ring just <laughs> fell out, girl. And that was my favorite one. It had Leo on it. If y'all didn't know, I'm a Leo. My birthday August first, and I had I had hit my belly button um, like a month and a half ago. I think I recorded whenever the last time I cleaned out my car. So not this past vlog, but the other one, and I hit it really hard and it like started gushing blood so i feel like it basically has to heal all over again but it was healing up really really well and now i feel like it's back in that healing process but it's like 10 times worse and i cannot find that belly button ring but luckily i had this other this is the one that they gave me when they thought i was going to swell up and i didn't so i got really lucky with that one but Luckily, I have this very, very long one. So, make sure I put this hole on tight. I got a long one. And this one, I feel like, let me hear. I feel like this one is the one I need right now while it's still in its weird healing process since it wanna be really stupid. So I'm like tighten this hole up. So I feel like it's on there tight. It's like bleeding too. I wanna show y'all, but here's the Q-tip. It got blood on it. But girl, I like that one. I'm so mad. I was just uh, thinking about you. Who, <laughs> oh, girl, let me, I'm, I'll get with y'all when I get done. I don't want the pussy, he can keep it. Money in the power for respect, cause I don't need it. Driving to the west, I popped the bean and now I'm speeding. Know some people in the six that this All right, so I had to get off because Nikki had called me. But I'm about to close my blinds or shades, whatever. It's not really blinds. <laughs> I usually keep this one about right there because i like for my plant to get like sunlight and stuff and don't my body like i'm on the second floor so that doesn't matter but this side over here i need to put these down because i usually leave all my shades up during the day mostly because can't nobody see in but at nighttime you know people can see in so usually bring it down to about right there fireplace on um I laid out everything. Oh, I just got done eating. Sorry I didn't show y'all, but I just put my macaroni in a bowl and then this is the aftermath. I'm actually, mm, I'm actually not done with my steak, but I'm gonna set it aside so I can put all this stuff up and then I'm gonna come back and finish eating. And then I gotta clean up my mess. Prince is up in the park and it's never knows what. Somebody outside, I think. 
I know a lot of you thought it matters. <laughs> okay, so this is the stuff I got. I think I already showed everything, but I just wanted to talk about a few things like these. I got three of these. I think I showed y'all this in the store. This is gonna be for milk, orange juice, and cranberry juice. I'm probably gonna set all that up tomorrow because I was so tired, y'all. I didn't eat so much today. Um, I didn't even wanna go grocery shopping. I did actually go to Walmart though and bought this steak and stuff, but I'm gonna finish everything tomorrow. Um, y'all saw I got this warmer. This is gonna go in my bathroom to replace the um, Febreze plug-in because I don't really have nothing to go in that corner because of, it's like a weird, anyways, this is going in the bathroom. <laughs> and then I got a lot of cleaning stuff. Um, tonight, I was gonna try to put up my shower curtain, but I'm honestly like really tired, especially since I just ate, I'm kind of like, just ready to shower and lay down and i also need to do a shower i'm going to record a shower routine so that's going to be up i'm going to do that tomorrow but i'm going to finish this vlog out tomorrow but yeah i finally found one that i like that's very affordable um yeah the only thing i have to do is just put this random stuff up um my bar card i think i told y'all ordered that that's not going to be here until either sunday or monday today is thursday so yeah um after i take a shower i'm probably going to do a load of clothes my battery is dying so i'm probably going to switch on my battery um show you guys doing my laundry and stuff like that and then i'm going to get back with y'all tomorrow and then we're going to like really put everything up and i'm going to finish going grocery shopping so this day in my life turned into <laughs> two days in my life but i feel very accomplished today i got a lot done um prince is looking good i got him on a little sweater right now and i also went to lush and sephora this may cut off on me but you'll see this in my um shower routine i'm going to talk about it a little more over there and then from sephora i got the fenty scrub if you guys saw me looking at that earlier and then from bath and body works i just got a hand sanitizer um like refiller i got the one that's because i work at the hospital so i got this one so cute so yeah that's all for today and i'll talk to you lovelies tomorrow earlier today but it is the next day it's friday now 2 12 um i went to go get my car um my oil change and tires rotated and stuff like that so yeah they did everything I only paid 102 dollars for a tire rotation and oil change and then you know all that stuff so i'm about to go into big lots now i'm over here um about to go in and return my shower curtain rod and these disinfectant wipes that i got that doesn't smell too good so i don't even want them anymore okay so these are the hooks that i got i think i showed you guys i should have showed y'all these already but the ones i wanted on amazon were black and they were like 26 dollars and these were only i want to say like 11 so if i wanted to i really could have like spray painted these white but i got a white curtain so i don't want that or I could have spray painted them black. But I'm just gonna keep them silver because my accents and stuff are silver, so I think it'll tie in pretty good. So I'm just gonna put these on my shower curtain and then I'm gonna put up the shower curtain. fall down i'm just gonna have to do like a command strip or something 
and then like put the command strip on the end of it and then just like stick and screw it. But I'm gonna start putting up the curtain now. I have one little hook on. I'm gonna put a few more hooks on. I'm gonna put a hook on each end and then I'm gonna start hooking it in the middle to make it easier. Nikki on the phone, y'all. Let me put the camera down so y'all can see what I'm talking about. See? It don't fit the bottom completely. <laughs> I'm about to bring the pole down some and see if that changes anything. She said she thought I was going to get a half rod. <laughs> I don't like that it's that low, like the, the bar that looks odd. No, I'm gonna have to order a long ass shower curtain. This is the top of it. I don't like that you can still see that. I want the rail up above the glass. So then I will need a shower curtain that's long enough to do that. But I do like the shower curtain. I just wish it was longer. Okay, so this is the shower curtain when it's just pulled to the open part. So that's how I'm gonna have it anyway because I do like the actual clear part. So I'm just gonna leave it like that. But y'all know, I can't deal with this. Like that, something's gotta give. But the show curtain is nice. Okay, so I'ma leave it up for now because I can't make up my mind because I'm an overthinker and indecisive. But I just posted on my Instagram story for y'all to vote. So I have for the ones who want me to get a longer shovel curtain, it's at 47%. And then all y'all who said it looks fine is at 53%. So <laughs> we'll see. Um, I already did order a longer one off Amazon. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but I think I wanna actually like end this vlog today. I kinda just want it to be a two day vlog. I don't wanna drag it out through the weekend cause it is supposed to only be like a day. So I'm gonna um, wash a little bit and you know, clean up the house and stuff like that and end that vlog off here today. But I'm not gonna get the shower curtain until Sunday. So I'm gonna probably be vlogging again and do another like type of vlog or something. And then we'll, I'll update y'all when I get it. But um, I also put in my community tab to follow me on Instagram, but I will put it on screen. It's at underscore Akira with three A's and yeah. Hello, y'all are voting. I'm super excited. Y'all help me out a lot because I normally do these a few times. So 53% says no, it looks fine, but we'll be the judge of that when I actually get the longer one. So a lot of y'all have been voting. If you see yourself, shouts out to you. Little mini promo for you guys. <laughs> um, I didn't click on everybody, but a lot of y'all are voting, so I do thank you guys. And then this is for No It Looks Fine. So, yeah, I'm about to do some laundry and then I'll probably shower and stuff. The thing is with the fabric ones, I don't put them inside the shower. Um, I was watching, I was looking at some reviews on Amazon from the shower curtain I just bought and it is fabric. And some people actually use fabric shower curtains as like, to block the water and they're mad that it's molding what did you expect <laughs> especially if you're not washing your shower curtain constantly if you're using it actually for that purpose this is literally just i'm going to get a shower liner but for right now i just want to just the cover so i don't get cold in the shower but i'm just like duh it's molding what do you <laughs> get a shower liner and not a freaking girl anyways i can run about that for a minute but i'm about to um Go put these clothes in this washer and the rest of this will probably be like sped up put a cute video or whatever
if you've been following me since my last apartment or last two apartments um this is what i used to keep my like tissue and paper towels and stuff in so i'm gonna put all of my extra um comforters and throw blankets and stuff for so when people come over they can just grab up out of here this is gonna take up the whole day <laughs> this big old comforter right here so i'm gonna smush that down as good as i can I don't know if I should roll them or just do them like this and just stack them down. Cause I feel like this one rolled is like really big, but I don't know. Let me see. These are extra pillowcases. These are actually king pillowcases, but I don't have any more king pillows, so I can't use them. So till I buy some more pillows, I'm just gonna save these. And this one I think I may throw away because I don't even need that. But these other ones I'm going to save. I need to actually iron or steam them, but whatever. That one in here. Okay, they fit. They all fit. So all of my throw blankets and comforters and stuff is in here. And I'm going to put this inside my closet. I think I'll get my other stool. So I'm about to put that bear that Bay got me up here and kind of move some of this other stuff around. <laughs> all of like my batteries um screws nails it, it basically like my hardware type of drawer um and basically my tool drawer i guess you can say and i've always kept it in this but i do have a spare um drawer in my kitchen that i was thinking of maybe putting this stuff in and kind of have it organized because i literally just throw everything in there and i'm like girl you can organize this a little better <laughs> so I think I may do majority of everything that I can organize, like the batteries and the um, nails and screws, because I have this one just empty. And this one basically needs to be empty too, but it's like just papers and instructions. So this is empty. Um, these two I have stuff in though. So I think I'm gonna try to organize like the batteries and most of that stuff in this one. Okay, so this is the drawer we're going to be working with. These are the extra little organizers that I have left over. So basically what I have to organize is batteries, um, screws and nails, little bitty tools and command strips, hooks, stuff like that. And yeah, so I think I'm going to use this one for one and maybe another long one and then maybe a medium one. I'm thinking this long one can do, since this one isn't really acrylic, this is just flimsy. Um, I would rather put the hard tools in there instead of something like this because this can crack really easily. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna drop these heavier tools up in here. Not sure if these are old or not, but I think I may just throw these out, honestly and throw these out. These are probably old. 
and then I'm gonna put these new ones in. Okay, so my closet is cleaned out. Um, has a lot more walk space. And I did some rearranging up there. And up there, as you can see. Um, I'm gonna color coordinate tomorrow, but I just wanted everything off the floor, which I did that. I'm gonna get a hamper where I can do two things, like it's put together so I can do towels and then just like regular clothes. So I'm gonna get rid of that brown one and this pink one probably. Um, that blue bag, I think I already told y'all, that's gonna be Goodwill donations. Um, that is basically office stuff. I'm trying to find a table that I can make an office out of to go over there in that corner by my vanity. And then basically I'm gonna like organize these drawers and stuff like that in another vlog. But yeah, basically I got a lot of walk space. I got space to grow, which we love. So I got that shelf empty, that shelf empty. Um, basically all of that, I can actually probably put that foot thingy under my bed honestly and then that steamer i can put under my bed but like the other two things will probably just stay there um i'm gonna go through those wigs and stuff tomorrow that thing is full of wigs i put my shoes up oops that's more over there and yeah stuff back there but basically everything is in order these wigs on the bed <laughs> are wigs that I'm gonna sell. So I got this one from SVT that I'm gonna sell. This one that I reviewed, I think about a year and a half ago. This one, and then this is a headband wig. So I got four wigs to put on sale. And then tomorrow, since I don't have anything to do but sell my TV, I'm um, selling my TV because I need a, big, a bigger one. Um, I can't see <laughs> at night. So yeah, I'm selling this one tomorrow by some, but, um, can I talk y'all? Dang. <laughs> it's um, one of my friends that I went to nursing school with. She's getting that one. And then this one is still on sale. This one is going to be for $150. So yeah, that's all for this vlog. So that's all for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed spending two days with me instead of just one. Um, I'm going to probably do another one of these videos probably either like Sunday or Monday. Um, Sunday I may do like a Sunday reset or something. I don't know. Um, maybe I'll do that like the next Sunday because I kind of already, I, I'm cleaning everything and washing stuff. Anyways, I'll see y'all in my next vlog or day in the life with me. So bye guys. <laughs>